in this movie, I want to talk about how to render a QMD file on RStudio or RStudio Cloud. So this is our QMD file. Uh, let's say that we have written the code and everything looks good. Um, there are two ways of rendering it. We can render it into an HTML. That's the default in the way we set up the file. So I would click on render. And it's going to, if there are no errors, RStudio will render the file into an HTML. And we get this nicely formatted HTML file, which if we wanted to, we could then save as a PDF uh, by clicking here, print, save as a PDF, and then save this locally. So this would save the PDF of our knitted HTML file. The second way to do this is that we can change the settings within the QMD file. Uh, so if you look at this code chunk here, the default is HTML. We can change the default to PDF. And now it is going to render our QMD file into a PDF file. So I click on render. Instead of this intermediary step of first getting it an HTML and then converting it into PDF to share it um, on Moodle or other uh, platforms, we could just get a directly rendered PDF file, which we can then save locally. We can download this to our machine. And then we can work with this. So this is, so this looks a little different from the one we converted from HTML because it has uh, some additional spacing in there. But both the ways are fine. Now, this is a more direct way where we can, again, just change the output or the format of our rendered file here, PDF or HTML, and then RStudio will render it in our requested format.